Lady Yuna, we've been expecting you. We were surprised you decided to come so soon. Pleasantly surprised, of course. Lord Seymour sends his apologies for having left without notice. It's quite all right. I have one question, if I may, sir. Milady? I want to keep journeying, even if I marry. Do you think that Maester Seymour would let me? But of course, my lady. Lord Seymour wishes nothing else, I'm sure. Uh, goodbye. Well, we must follow Grotto tradition. I'll have to ask you to wait here a little while longer. I'll send someone to escort you. I... We're all with you. Do as you will. Thank you. Sorry. Hmm? That was your line. Yuna! Milady. Riku! Efem dan vidran! Aistra guardian of Yuna, wika? Yuna kva? Fafem kintran, krak kva? Tu drek ye moha, Ketan. I told him I was a guardian. Well, yes, I had to, really. How come you speak out bed? Why? Uh, well, uh... Because I'm out bed. And that was my brother. You knew? Mm. Hmm. Why didn't you tell me? We knew you'd be upset. This is great. I can't believe I've been traveling with an out bed, a heathen. You're wrong. We have nothing against Yevon. But you out bed used to forbid him machina. You know what that means? Sin was born because people use machina. You got proof? Show me proof. It's in Yevon's teaching. Well, not that you know. That's not good enough. Yevon says this, Yevon says that. Can't you think for yourself? Well, then you tell me. Where did sin come from, huh? I. I don't know. <laughs> You badmouth Yevin, and that's all you can come up with. But that doesn't mean you should do whatever they say without thinking. Nothing will ever change that way. Nothing has to change. You want Sin to keep coming back? There might be a way to stop it, you know. Sin will be gone once we atone for our past mistakes. 
When? How? If we keep faith in Yevon's teachings, it will be gone one day. Why do I even bother? Riku. Hmm? Will this move? Yes! We're not using that, are we? Wait. So Aron isn't out bet too, is he? Come on, Waka. What? I mean, getting angry just because you found out Riku's in our bed. You guys got along fine till now, didn't you? That's different. I mean... Well, I don't claim to know that much about Spira. And I probably know even less about the our bed, but... I know Riku's a good person. She's just Riku. Lou? No. Just think of this as an opportunity to learn more about the our bed. Ha! <coughs> Let him go. Give him time to think. I'm sorry. You've done nothing to apologize for. All right! Let's ride! You sure you know how to drive this? Better than Kamari does. Sorry about Waka. <laughs> he didn't have to be so mean, yeah? I almost cried. Yeah, Riku. Just kidding. It's okay. At least you're still nice. Hey, do I look like Uni, you think? Huh? Well, my dad's sister is Uni's mother. You get it? Hmm. Ah. I had no idea. If you say so. Mm-hmm. Okay. I guess you're guarding your family then. Yuna's not the only one that I want to protect. Huh? We all bet want to protect all of the summoners, you know? Summoners are... Well, you could say that they sacrifice themselves too well to bring happiness to Spira. What do you mean? Oh. Riku? Yes? Sacrifice themselves? You know, the pilgrimage. It, uh, takes a lot out of you. Oh, right. But you know, Yuna's real serious about being a summoner. For Yuna, well, the pilgrimage kind of means everything to her. You are going to help her too, aren't you, Riku? Mm. So you shouldn't say that Yuna's sacrificing herself. Uh, Riku? I hope you're right. The likes of her are not welcome in this hallowed place. She is a guardian. A, an all bed? A guardian? Preposterous. I've decided to be Yuna's guardian now. And that's all I want. And that's all one needs to be a guardian. Very well. <laughs> 